it's you know it's humbling um it's humbling all your life uh you work to get into a show that is not only successful but also rewarding creatively um and lion king is uh lion king is all of that and i think uh you know the story itself um uh is uh is what we can attribute that success that success to you know the heart of the uh the heart of the story is uh kind of what makes it you know what makes it successful and you know all the uh technical elements that you see in the show you know the moving pieces and the fancy costumes and all of that are simply just to support this amazing story that we get to be a part of and i think that that is the uh the uh the major contributing factor to the success of the show For me, it's uh, Broadway is, is kind of big, right? And they have uh, different, the rock comes from the, from the ground coming up. And there's so many, like they have the rake and everything. I think that, that's what makes it even more spe spectacular, even on Broadway. But here, too, I mean, I remember when I came in to join in the first time, they were like, I, I was like, no, I don't want to watch the show. And I don't want to do no rehearsal because I know the show. And Debbie was like, no, you need to come in. You need to, you know, rehearsal because we rehearse. Because what, we, what you have on Broadway, we don't have it here. The rock comes from the side, and we don't have no rake and everything. So um, you need to come in. And when I did it, I was like, oh, my God. It totally was, like, different. But the story is the same. Everything is great. I mean, you know, all the characters are the same. It's just, like, little, little things that are, like, different. Um, it, it's, it's, it's been great. Uh, definitely, you know, each city kind of has, uh, their own feel and, you know, the pulse of the city is different and how they respond to, uh, how they respond to the show. Um, I like to say, or I have been saying, you know, and we've been talking about it backstage and stuff that Memphis is kind of, a you know, hard on the sleeve type city where, you know, whatever they're feeling, they allow to come out. And that, you know, really helps, uh, really helps us on stage as well. We feel that energy, but uh, it's not even the energy. Um, it's it's you know everything that goes along with that. Um, I was saying to somebody that I was coming around during Circle of Life, and uh, as the rock comes around, we can see people in the audience, and there's a uh, this big burly guy that's sitting in the front row, just bawling his eyes out. You know what I mean? And it's uh you, that's really refreshing to you know to see that uh, that happen. You know, um, and people not be so reserved with their feelings. So uh, it definitely adds uh, uh, adds to our performance. Um, and we appreciate it. So it's uh, it's been great to have such an enthusiastic audience. For me, I, I don't want to be in a hotel because I feel like I, I wouldn't know much about that place if I'm living in a hotel where else, if you're out in the suburbs, you get to belong. You feel like you are part of, you know, the community. So that's why it's so fascinating for, you know, for me to be able to you know, living in a, in a, like, Airbnb or whatever. And I think that kind of plays into, uh, I think that kind of plays into our show, too. You mm -hmm. know, uh, it, it being um, a very, you know, family and community-based theme of a show, you know, theme of a show. Like, the themes of the show are very community-based. And, uh, you know, with Nala and those things and her mm -hmm. taking care of her community mm -hmm. and Mufasa yeah. passing, you know, passing down that knowledge. Uh, so I think that kind of plays into, uh, I mean, at least, it, at least it does for me, um, plays into why I like to be kind of out in the community as well. You know, the history alone, number one, is, is amazing, but I think uh, a theater like this, uh, it being so ornate, really, really support, it fits well with the, uh, fits well with the show. Um, you know, with all of the, the, the costumes and the uh, majesty of, you know, the sets and all of that, it kind of really fits, uh, fits well with the, uh, you know, with the show. And I think kind of sets the tone for what people are gonna see once the curtain does go up. But just the, uh, you know, just the history of, um, the history of a house uh, of a house like this is uh, amazing to be a part of as a as a performer. It's my preference, actually, you know, to uh, kind of go into a, go into a theater like this.